Hey guys, welcome to this week's video from Propulsion Swimming. Now, as all of you competitive swimmers will know, having a great dive and more importantly, a great streamline is really gonna help you when you're racing. Now, the best swimmer in the world for this is Caleb Dressel. And a few weeks ago on his Instagram, he set a distance of 24.9 meters on just a dive and glide. So what we're gonna do in this week's video is both me and Dan, who's not here right now, we're gonna to attempt to beat this, or at least see how close we can get. But before we do that, why don't we take a look at Dressel's attempt and see why he's able to go quite that far. What gives Dressel a great advantage in this particular challenge is his ability to spring off the blocks. His next aim is to make sure his entry into the water is slick and smooth, with the ultimate goal to create as little splash and as little drag as possible. Of course, during this part of the dive and for the rest of the challenge, the streamline position is critical. Having a tight streamline position where you squeeze your legs and arms together is vital when gliding through the water. If you use an incorrect streamline technique, you're likely to generate unnecessary resistance through the water, which will ultimately slow you down quicker and reduce the distance you're able to travel through the water. Now, it's not just about the streamline position. As he glides through the water, he really squeezes his core tight to maintain that straight body position. And the final thing he does, which makes this distance almost impossible to beat, is the fact that he holds his breath for over 40 seconds, meaning he's able to squeeze those extra centimeters out of that glide position. Now I know I said the distance that dress or covered is close to impossible to beat, but what we're gonna do is we're gonna see just how far our technique gets us through the water in a dive and glide challenge. Thank you for watching this week's video from Propulsion Swimming. If you enjoyed it, please subscribe, click the like button, and don't forget to leave a comment below to let us know just how far you, at home, managed to get through the water in your glide positions. We look forward to seeing just how much further than us you got, and if any of you were able to get anywhere near the distance that Caleb Dressel got in his challenge. Thanks for watching, I've been Scott, this has been the Propulsion Swimming YouTube channel, and I'll catch you on the next one.